Okay, Lauren Hughes here coming from a field in Colorado, nice and full of allergies, so we'll see how well I last this evening. <laughs> Let's talk cold calling. So any realtors, any salespeople out there, this video is for you. How to catch the person's attention within the first 30 seconds. And I would say, well, right now I'm actually doing cold calling as a realtor, uh, building up my fifth business, Hughes Capital. And I'm telling you that because, well, we'll talk about that in just a minute, but let's talk about how to get my attention. And what I'm seeing right now is I'm a little disturbed by what I'm seeing in the sales industry right now, actually. So Hughes Capital is my fifth company. I still have an owner stake in LD Studios Rails Agency, and I'm an advisor for a couple other companies. So I get a lot of sales calls, and I have a lot of people calling me wanting to sell me something. And I would say, at least five calls every single day so I would say the average person that you're calling they're gonna give you 30 seconds whether or not they decide they're gonna work with you or not I'm probably gonna give you 10 seconds 10 seconds to tell me what on earth you're calling me for and whether or not I'm gonna continue that phone call and if you can make it past one minute with me on the phone you are a rock star and let me tell you what those people do that make it past that one minute mark with me one you are using a script. I do think it's important for people to use scripts, but you need to be able to go off the script. That's one of the, I think that's the biggest thing that's concerning me right now. Everyone's so focused on their script. I can't people to, I can't get people to get out of their script. And if I'm asking you questions within that first like minute, it probably means I might actually be interested in what you have to sell. So you need to be able to jump out of that script and not try to steer the conversation in order to, for you to get your who, what, when, where, and why. I need you to focus on me. And that's the biggest thing I've been noticing with scripts. People won't get out of their script even when they need to. I've specifically asked people, I'm like, hey, can we put the script down and can we have a conversation? Because I, I said, what you've said has, I've, I'm intrigued, can we just have a conversation? More, t more often than not, I'm not able to get them out of that conversation or out of their script. And I can't work with people that can't get out of their script. So that's just a deal breaker right there. But I would say if you are a salesperson, make sure your first 30 seconds are impeccable and you are friendly and you are smiling. Uh, the Cheesecake Factory uses a hiring technique called the two second rule, or it's the two, li two second likability. And that's what happens when you meet people face to face. You typically decide whether or not you like them within the first two seconds of meeting them. Something similar happens over the phone, so if you have a tendency to come off not as friendly, try you know, try smiling or try putting a pencil in your mouth because it's gonna force you to smile and you, uh, it's, it's uh, a higher probability of people liking you. So if you are a salesperson making those cold calls or working in person now, hey, we can be in person now, it's that first 30 seconds are in, they are the most important 30 seconds in any type of meeting because that's gonna dictate the rest of the show. So set the expectation at the beginning, make sure you're able to listen. You do have a script, but you are able to also be a human. You don't wanna, it's a fine balance between being a robot, well scripted, and then just being a robot that there's no point even talking to a human if we can't have a human conversation. So thank you guys for tuning in. All realtors out there, all salespeople out there, get your scripts down, but be able to get, jump out of the script if you have someone that is in, uh, uh, interested in having a real conversation. And that's what I'm noticing a lot is that the real conversations are harder to have. And maybe that's just like, I don't know, COVID hangover. We don't know how to be human anymore. We're like, script, script, robot, dirt, dirt. We just need to be human again. So thanks guys for tuning in.